All right, so for this Blender how-to video, uh, I'm gonna show you how to like select faces and stuff like um, edges and vertices, mainly, mainly faces uh, that are in like a circular pattern like this, or just in general. It'll just be easier to make, uh, it'll just be to make your life easier. So um, one way you can do it, like let's say you wanna select all these faces in that inner circle, right? Uh, you can press Shift, Control, Alt, and then select any any of the faces here and then that'll select them all like that pretty fast easy and saves you some time um, another thing you can do is uh, let's see select this face and select another face and then select shift control and with the number pad press the plus button and it'll select it will keep adding uh, faces. So if like, let's say you just wanna select half of this circle, great. If not, keep on adding and it'll select uh, the rest of them. And like, let's say you wanna deselect like these two right here, great, you know, that's all. Or yeah, if you wanna deselect, uh, just press the negative on the, on the button too. Uh, let's see, I think there's like a third way. Okay, so select the face, then Alt Control, and then select the, the next two faces, I guess, and that'll select them all. So if you just really wanna do all the faces in that inner circle, the easiest way is, a, is Control is shift control all and select any face uh, what we're going to do is we are going to go to the side go to see through and we're going to expand this so it looks a little more so it looks more bulking so s and then we're going to contain it within the x within the x the axis like this but we also forgot we gotta move this what do you call it we gotta select the faces over here. So press C. And yeah, you could also use this the C or again the X, um, the circular sorry, the circular or the box tool, uh, selection tools to do that. But again, you know, shift control all to select all the faces in that circle. Uh, it's pretty fast. So yeah. Uh new shortcut or new way to do it. All right, so press one, C through S, X. Oh, okay, guess maybe I was wrong here. Yeah. We don't wanna select everything. X. Oh, and that's pretty good. All right, so it gives it some oomph, makes it more, uh, what do you call it, more uh, modelly. <laughs> All right, sorry about that. All right, so um, those are the three ways that you can select um, circular objects or circular faces. Another way, another, I guess I'll show you again. Uh, let's say we want to select the faces in just in this you see in that kind of circle but it gets to structure right here so again control shift sorry control shift oh select that face like it'll select almost everything but it gets disrupted with this face and these two other faces so then just shift and add the add them and then you can you know, modify them if you wish. Um, let's see, if you wanna just do the edges here, uh, I think you could probably do the same thing. Control Shift, Alt, nope. So another thing we can do, uh, cause we just wanna do the edge of the outer loop, would be Shift, 
so select again then shift control then plus 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 see and so yeah this gives you wider range uh, of options to select faces in circular patterns i uh, hope this helps and best of luck